if you're not taking action, here's why. This is the 365 Days of Multi-Level Marketing Journey to Freedom Podcast with Rome Bachelor, where Rome shares his daily journey from down and out to total financial freedom in one year, along with pro tips, tricks, strategies, and tools to help you join in on the journey. Now, here's Rome with today's Journey to Financial Freedom Podcast. We've spoken about motivation and motivation magic and, you know, what causes people to take action and what causes people not to, you know, needs times faith or desire times belief. Uh, motivation is uh, got psychological elements, fear of rejection, fear of success, uh, you, you know, peer pressure. These things do affect us. However, for most network marketers, we're willing to try. Uh, we don't even sign up unless we have hope and belief that it's possible. So those, while building belief is the number one goal we should build in ourselves and in our teams uh, and prospective uh, oncoming leaders and new people, always build belief. That's goal number one. And then adding fuel to our dreams, you know, connecting with our pain points and our why. We've spoke about these things numerous times and, and, and dream building, you know, what's possible, using the imagination to realize the power of residual income and what freedom will bring for you when you're not tied to the dollar bill, when you're not a slave to a schedule that other people create for you, but you are a free man or a free woman, a free child of God, living your life with dignity, honor, and the ability to make choices instead of those choices being made for you, then you become a full adult. Then you become fully mature and fully alive in this life and you have awoken and come out of the cocoon, so to speak, so you can fly your life with freedom as you were designed to do. That's the natural state of mankind is freedom, but society, sin, corruption, the world, pressure, expectations, and all this garbage has come in and corrupted us since the Garden of Eden that's causing us to be enslaved mentally, spiritually, primarily spiritually, but also with our schedules in our life because of uh, all these demands because of the way the system is set up, right? So the, the most free system is the free enterprise system, the most free system in the world, the most uh, a powerful system to enable you to free yourself getting back to the natural state of what man how man was intended to live when we were created is the free enterprise system and the purest form of pre free enterprise is network marketing for the average person because it doesn't require the investment or the risk and it has the upside potential to buy your life back as in traditional business you can do that, but often there's so much money tied up, there's so much overseeing uh, that's required that you really never get freedom in traditional business. The one model that can free you and buy your life back to the original intention of how we were designed is network marketing because you not only buy your life style, but you also buy, that includes buying your time back and your choices back without being constricted or refined or having to constantly oversee some hectic uh, business and other people, you're actually free here. So what keeps us from taking action? Back to the main point. That was just a little introduction, side note. But what keeps us from taking action is we don't often see it. That means we don't see the end result. That, doesn't, that means we sometimes don't see the potential. Sometimes, though, and most often, it's because we don't see how the steps in our process work together. We don't have a full image of how simple and easy it's supposed to be and how it's supposed to look. And often that's because either our company or our team 
doesn't have a clear-cut system, or there's nobody willing to walk us through the steps three, four, five times enough, up to seven times, to get it, to get it, to observe, observe it enough to, so that we can see it. So if you're not taking action, here's the key for today. Reevaluate your process. Reevaluate your steps that you take to build the business. What does your system look like? Look at it and find somebody who has a simple enough system that with just a little bit of attention and a little bit of practice, you can get it enough to really see it. See, if you see it, you don't have to try to motivate yourself to do it. If you see it, you will take action on it. If your downline sees the business and sees the process, you won't have to try to get them to do it if you can only get them to see it. The best way to see it is demonstration, but demonstration on a simplified system that actually is also effective. It can be so simple and doesn't produce results. That's not going to work. It's got to be effective, but it's got to be simple as possible so that people can see themselves doing it and getting the end result that they desire. And if you've got that, then you've got a winning formula for not only yourself, but your team. Now here's the other key. If you don't have that right now, what good is learning all this other stuff? If you haven't slowed down enough to reevaluate what your process is, and is it something you can see yourself doing? That's the pro tip of the day. Is your process something that you and your team can see themselves doing. Because if it's more complicated than that, then it's bound not to duplicate and you won't have the results that you're looking for, especially in a business that involves teamwork and a, and a, and a growing team. That's today's podcast. If you can see it, you can do it. If you can see yourself doing it, if you can see handing out samples, if you can see, you know, the process and it's something you can believe is reasonably doable for you, then guess what? As long as you see the reward on the end, you'll see your, you, you, and you can see the process of how to do it, then you'll find yourself and you'll see yourself actually doing the process. That is day 40. You don't have to get yourself to do it. You have to get yourself to see it. And then the doing is the byproduct. Until next episode, this was day 40. Thank you for joining me on your journey to freedom. Thank you for sharing today's 365 Days of MLM to Freedom podcast. And remember to email your questions and comments directly to Rome at 365 Days of MLM at gmail.com. And until next time, we want to encourage you to join in on the journey.